All right, and good day. Welcome back to another Minecraft stream. Welcome, welcome. Hey, Steven, already in there today. Hello. <laughs> we are back in Sky Factory 4. Whoop, my head collection is coming along nicely. We're going to have to do something with these heads. I haven't decided exactly what I want to do with them this time. But I got so many. I feel I need to be somewhere decorative. I just don't know what to do with them yet. Um, so, today. What I do today? Let's talk about today. So, I spent a little time in the nether, farming netherrack, and adding it to our compressed netherrack system, just to try to help give that a little boost. Uh, it helped a little bit, but it's still a ways to go. I'm going to have to do that quite a bit this week. I'm going to have to oomph up our netherrack production. Uh, I have not checked the black holes yet. We'll do that. Check the black hole. See if what we did yesterday helped at all. Um, and then I finished up this over here and getting it going. So this is all set up now. I made a couple tweaks to it, but, uh, I put it together yesterday and nothing was working and I couldn't figure out why. I forgot I have to crush the lithium. <laughs> so, um, this is a head of production. So this, I, we've got crushed lithium dust in a black hole. We got 60,000 in there. Uh, because this only runs at night, and this tank is already full, full. Uh, we've already got a full tank of that. Everything building up behind it is just in lithium dust form, because it doesn't take long for this to process. This will pop that through fast. So this is the bottleneck is that we just don't have any use for it. We did. I did go ahead and get it connected, so we've got it in there. I did connect the other tank we put up there yesterday, but I haven't messed with it. Hello, Z. I haven't gone in and out of any compact machines. I took your advice, Stephen, yesterday, and I put a shrinky dink here so that I could go into the compact machine, which I did I did go ahead and finish with seeds. That took a while. And I did increase the size of storage uh, cells inside of the induction storage. That's why I didn't get much else done, because that took forever of just building and then bigger and then bigger and then bigger. So I, I just slightly more than doubled it. Um... When we take a look at our... Hey, Ezreal, how's it going? We look at our fission reactor. Uh, so far, TBU fills built up pretty good. The only downside is we burned through all of our boron already. So I'm trying to keep an eye on this to see whether or not we're getting enough boron to continue staying lateral. And it appears like it is. I think we're getting, we're getting enough that this is keeping the fuel right about the same amount. I'm not really going up or down. So that's fine. As long as it runs it forever, we're good. Um, and then it has no power really stored. There's a smidgety smidge in there, but there's almost no power stored because a lot of power shot into those induction storage once I added those. Uh, so, <clears throat> yeah, so we got this one. We got tier one, lithium. Now over here, we've got to do deuterium, and there's a much easier way to do it that I'd forgotten about. Uh, when I was just looking through the stuff to prepare for today, I realized it was a drastically easier way to do it than what I was going to do. So, that's good. Uh, so, <clears throat> that'll have our mechanism reactor up and running. I haven't cleaned this out yet. Okay, we're going to we're gonna definitely work on some statues today. Get at least some of those done. Maybe all, but more likely some. Because I have a feeling I'll get bored halfway through. <laughs> so, we'll see. Put that in there. Continue. It's another slow but steady way to get some pearls, too. You don't get a lot, but it's a little bit. A little bit. Let's put all those in there. The double-click thing is just... There's too many things to click on. I can't remember if there was anything else I did today. I don't think there was. Most of it was the induction stuff. So that was... And then I, I made folders for all the stuff that... We had made yesterday, so all the folders are done. So let's see how many chorus we're at today. Chorus. We got 170. <clears throat> I want to say that's enough, or at least it's pretty close to enough to make all the statues we need. I can always go farm a few. And then the statues are going to go down here when they're done. I have a feeling I'll need more pedestals than that, but it's a start. Oh, hold on one second.
Oh, still muted. Sorry. Uh, my wife was down feeding the kitty. I was talking to her. I'm sorry. I didn't hit. I hit the button to unmute and didn't mute fast enough. We're in here taking a look at the compact machines, and unfortunately, it is not looking good. It is taking much longer than I expected. Normally, we, we aren't as advanced as we are this quickly into the series, and this has more time to fill up. I'm, we still got time. I'm going to be working on fusion reactors for a couple weeks, so that's a thing to do, but yeah, yeah. So yeah, so there's that. So we got some more work to do on that. I may have to manually pull some of that out. I also have a sandwich in front of me I'll be eating throughout the stream, so don't judge me in my eating habits, please. <laughs> I was one sandwich down, one sandwich to go at the beginning of stream. Uh, this is filling up nicely. <laughs> I've got lots of supplies. Nothing's really better than what I have. But I'm going to try and fill up a, a whole row of everything, except for this. I'm not getting many of the spines, but, uh, uh, you know, we're filling it up, making it look cool. I did get a cool, I got, finally got a, a, a an overclocked sniper, which was nice. So, mm. my meal after stream yesterday was delicious. It was just drowned in queso, and I loved every second of it. And I appreciate your uh, uh, asking. You remembered. <laughs> we have the we got the achievement for that yesterday, so I don't have to keep running those anymore. But we may have to run some boron seeds if the TBU fuel does start to wear out quicker than I'm making new ones. So we'll have to see. Um, <clears throat> what I have, I had Petros, which uh, if you're not familiar with that, it's a restaurant down here in the south. Um, I, they make basically what other areas call Frito pies. So it's a bunch of Fritos with chili on it, cheese, sour cream, tomato, and chives. Uh, they also offer one that's a queso one. And I ordered the queso, and I asked for extra queso, and they drowned it. It was literally, look, it looked like a container of just queso. You couldn't see anything else under it. They also have exceptional hot dogs, and I get their queso hot dogs as well. And I'd eaten those before stream, but I that had filled me up. And so I waited on the Petros till afterwards. <clears throat> so, power's looking good. Uh, this is charged. This is fully charged. So when we fire this up, this should be good. <clears throat> the two cities over here. Oh, that's right. It's hard for me to remember where everybody lives. <laughs> but yes, they just finally put one in Oak Ridge. Uh, a Petro's opened up a month or two ago, so we're good. Now they're building a Long John Silver's, and I'm going to tear that up when it opens, too. Broke my heart when they closed the last one. All right. <clears throat> All right, so now we need to get deuterium running. That's our other fuel. And you can do it this way and that way and add things and do so. This is the way we're going to do it, right? We're going to use an electrolytic separator, and we're going to put heavy water in it. And that's really all there is to it. That is heavy water. What is the, what is the, where's the heavy water button? It's not showing me how to get the heavy water. But I know, it's a, a pump with a filter in it. So we're going to do that. <clears throat> so we'll go backwards. Electrolytic separator. I believe that's what I just said. Electrolytic separator. Yes. Uh, do I have any? I do not. Okay. Electrolytic separator. We need one of these guys. Pushwa. Pushwa. Excellent. Wait. Did I just make two of the same thing? I did. That was silly. <laughs> there it is. Electrolytic separator. Okay. So the electrolytic separator, I'm just going to set it down. Uh, this shoots out the left and the right. And the front? Yes. Normally I would put a water source block on the back, but I can't do that this time. Uh, we're going to need tubes. I think. Yes, for the gas. And then I need the type of tubes that does water. Um, mechanism. <clears throat> mechanism. Boy. I spelled it totally wrong. I have been struggling with spelling mechanism. My goodness. I need a filter upgrade. I should only need one. <clears throat> Hopefully this is going to be enough to provide what we need for this machine. If not, we'll look into making more of them. But I want to say this is enough. We make one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight of those. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight of those. We're gonna need a flux. 
Uh, flux points. Uh oh, a lot of fluxy parts. Oh, didn't have many of those either. Well, it's enough to make one, and that's all I really need this minute. So we'll make a ton later. Filter in the pump before putting it in. That is correct. We have learned that mistake before. <laughs> then I need the pump, which is that guy. I made a whole bunch of enriched alloy today, too. That was super easy. Redstone and iron. So what is this? Oh, that's a pump from ranged pumps. Ranged pumps? That's in here? I don't think I've ever used ranged pumps. What else is in there? That's it. That's the only thing. Hold on a minute. Interesting. I've discovered a block I never knew was in this pack. Not the pump. Oh, I'm such an idiot. Ranged pump. We're going to figure out what we can do with that. That's on our to-do list. Anytime I find a block I've never seen before, I want to have something to do with it. Well, while I'm here, I can go ahead and put that in. That. Oh, it takes all of them, too. Okay, cool. Energy. I'll take a bite of my sandwich. Don't judge me. I'm wrong. You can judge that. <laughs> Bucket. Water. Let's grab some brick. Brick, 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 brick for building. Go ahead and get those in there as well. And I need to make more because I was going to put those in the electrolytic separator. I did not realize they went into the pump as well. Eight of each of those. Good. Right, tubes. That's why we came to this page originally. Tubes. Um, which the tubes that do water? Wait. Why is there only one type of tube? Let's see what is here. Uh, gases. Heat. Are there no water tubes? I thought there were water tubes in mechanism. Or universal tubes, or tubes that do also. I guess I'll use fluid extraction cables. Could have sworn. Or tubes. I guess not. I was wrong about my tube knowledge was limited. Do, 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 do. Electrolytic separator. Okay, so I'm going to need that guy to go there. Yes. And then it's gases. Well, I'm in mechanism in general. I mean, that's all of mechanism. It's not in mechanism. Which, unless mechanism has a second mod. Which is okay. I mean, it's not too big of a deal. Um, wait, I gotta... Let me go back over here. So one goes out the left, one goes out the right. I need the one that goes out the left. So that's turned the wrong way. So that needs to be here. So yeah, that one there. That one's in there. It'll go there. So no, that's the right spot, but the wrong facing. It needs to go here. Yes. Come out the left and up, and then the right side. I'm going to dump excess. And this side. Uh, we're just going to use idle, so when it's not running, it'll stop, because that's all I care about. <clears throat> Are those ones there? And then I'll need gases going here, because it's a gas that's our final product. And then fluid. I may not need a fluid, because the pump might connect right to it. Maybe that's the part I'm thinking. Which way does the pipe go? Opposite the way I wanted it to. Okay, good. So that means it goes like that. But I think, I think the fluid comes out of the top. I think that has to be for power. Ooh. Try that again. Yeah, the green is power. Huh. Okay, still doable. Still workable. Let's get rid of that. And that. Come on. Break. Slow ass machine. Okay. Gotta grip. Bricks. 
and it was coming right. My tubes, my tubes was there. Yes. And then I needed it to come out the left hand side, which is there. Yes. And then the tube will go there. And then this will go here. Yes. Yes. So I won't be able to plug her right well. I don't want the power facing the other. Oh, that needs power too. That can do both the power. That actually works out well. I'll power both machines right there. So now they'll get the juices. And then I'll have the the pipe, because it's going to be fluid. I should be able to use an extraction cable. We will see. Yeah, that'll work. That'll play. And now I just got to get water underneath it. Oh, and we've already obsidian down here. Convenience. If it let me put it in there. Oh, it's filling the void. Okay. Thought that might happen. It's okay, though. We can fix that. We fall, in the, fall in the hole, right? Water. Then I plug it up. Ah, I'll get these things out of the way for a minute. That should be pumping hard water into here. Which it is. The oxygen is filling up. And it'll dump out when it hits the top. And our deuterium. That, that should be deuterium. It's filling the machine right now. Let's see. Deuterium. Yes it is. Deuterium, as I like to say. <laughs> no, no. I just remember I do a two rate if I'm doing air cooled. All right. So we got to give this time to do some work and start building up some deuterium. That's full, so that's working it. Now that it's doing that, we have both fuels in here. Now we have to make the third type of fuel, which we only need a little bit for. Because we have to put it in our hold room. Hold room. I hate the word. I wish they had a better word for it. Why are they going to make it so hard to spell? It's probably a real thing. You know what I mean? It probably actually exists. And so it's named after what the thing really is. You know, in all the times, I've, I've never used wind generation in Sky Factory 4. I use it in lots of other packs I play, but I never use it here. So I need some coal or charcoal and some gold dust to make a hold room. Let's go do that first. Do, do, do. We only need like one of those, but we'll make a couple to be on the safe side. Uh, this guy, dump the excess redstone. Oh, I forgot to... Dang it. I forgot to put my upgrades in this machine. Let me do it before I forget. Power first. That was a big bite of mustard right there. Woo! Potent. What is your favorite homemade sandwich? So I'm not talking about one you like. You really like the Subway something or other, a big fancy one you get somewhere else. But if you're going to make a homemade sandwich, and you can make any homemade sandwich that you normally would make, what's your, maybe a go-to, that would probably be a better thing. What's your go-to sandwich, or what do you think is the best one to make at home? Inquiring minds need to know. Oh, good. I've already got some pulverized coal. Or gold. And we'll grab some coal. Flint coal. Uh, let's see. That. I don't have anything in there yet. Now I do. Ah! Too many holdems. Too many holdems. I forgot. I forgot. <laughs> forgot to have many of those made so quickly. Wait. Why are, oh, I know why. They went into my junk storage. Okay. Also, okay. Cavities, walls, are radio, within the cavity. Whew. That's smart people stuff right there. That is beyond my capabilities. All right. There's our whole... They should come up with an easier to pronounce version of that word. All right. So, this is going. Now that we've got that going, how's it working? Heavy water. Looks good. 
chili cheese hot dogs. That's not a sandwich. Hot dogs are not a sandwich. Plain bologna? How do you like your bologna, though? I'm a mustard, mayonnaise, and cheese on pretty much every type of meat. Turkey sandwich, ham sandwich, bologna sandwich. The amortized sandwich. And cut it into bite-sized pieces with a sliced banana eaten uses a fork. That's very strange. I don't think I've ever had anyone give me that answer. PBJ, yes. Rachel has said the correct answer. The grilled cheese sandwich is the superior sandwich. Should be recognized as such. <laughs> Although I do like a good PBJ sandwich. Why is this not filling up? Oh, idle. It reset it. Dumping excess. There we go. Whoop. Now we're back. I'm glad we found that now. Okay. Fried bologna and cheese. That's good. You've taken it to another level there, and I respect it. Woo. I put... A lot of mustard on that one. Well, it's perfection, but yes. Fried bologna and cheese sounds legendary. You're going to try that? Oh, yeah, yeah, 100%. It's good stuff. All right. We've got our deuterum going. <laughs> now we need DT fuel. That's what I got to fill with a horum. Uh, so I need this. So I need to take a little of that deuterium we're playing with. Mix it with some tritium. That's on the other side. And when we mix those two together, that will give us our DT fuel. So, there's that. Not hard to do. We'll go knock it out here real quick. Let me grab... Uh, we're going to do this super fast. Super fast, I think. Maybe not. Let me grab two tanks. Just little ones for this. We don't need much of this. All right, so there's two tanks. You know, I should have put DT T fuel in the memory bank. So, T, T. Need a chemical infuser. Okay, I can make one of those, maybe, I think. Chemical infuser. That guy. What am I missing? Nothing! That's excellent. All right, let's set him over here. Perderk. Actually, he needs some power. You know what? Let's, uh... Let's get a little crazy with the cheese was here. Let's uh, let's share the power, share the glory, if you will. Uh, where's my power? There it is. Burp. You got power? You got power. Excellent. So tank number one. Uh, what happened to my tanks? Oh, it used them in to make the thing I just made. Crap. Create no creative tank. I wish. Tank, 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 tank. tank. One of these guys, one of these guys, and when I set it down, it's facing me, correct? Yes, okay. Need some brick, brickety brick, brick, brick. Do, 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 do. Perfect. And. Do, 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 do. There. And boop. All right, that's going to get us a little of each of those fuels since we're already making them. Uh, PB and J is the bomb. PB and banana is an amazing combo. Yeah, I don't like banana with anything. I like I can eat a banana. I don't like banana flavored stuff, but I like eating just a banana. But I can't think of anything I like banana on or even with. Banana's my idea of a, I guess you'd say it would be like a quick breakfast. Grab a banana or two. Uh, tubes. Tube. 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 And then I need a finished, I need one more tank. Tank. Oh, ah, it was already there. Cool. Last tank. Whoa. All righty then. Uh, just technically, deuterium goes on the left. We probably already have enough. I don't need that much. There's zero in there, okay? I was wrong. It's filling that one up first. Okay. 
Well, what do you know? This will fix that. It's still putting zero in there. Why? Why is it? Why you gotta be like that? Oh, there's that, I guess. <laughs> the banana is not. It's still you, but you're you're mixing it and putting it in your mouth. The flavors are still combined. Pudding? No, banana pudding. Oh, gross. No, nope, can't do banana pudding. Don't like banana pudding. Don't like rice pudding. Don't like tapioca pudding. I like chocolate and butterscotch. Those are the only two acceptable puddings. Everything else is a conspiracy. Okay, is that working again? Yes, because it's set as an output. That one's still filling up. That one is too. Hey, I got it working this time. So I probably need to do the same thing over here. Yup. Make that an input and not an output so it'll get some gas. And then I'm just letting a little bit of that. I, they don't, I don't even need that much. It's a smidgety smidge. I'm sure I have enough. All right, deuterium goes on this side and I have to switch it back to being an output. Put it inside the machine. I'm gonna give this and just no, my God, that's even faster. Okay, grab that and put that one there. Also switching that to off. That should be making us DT fuel, but that also needs to be switched to input. DT fuel. There it is. Boom, shakalaka. Everything's coming up, Graven. Don't need those. And then I just put this guy in here. And it will fill him up. And we have a hold room. And I'll let that little, whatever's in those tanks, I'll finish off in case we need to fire this up again. We could have a false fire. It does happen. We already got it set to rate two, so we're good there. We've got fuel. Nothing's happening there yet because I haven't turned it on. How we looking? Flowing pretty steady. 38,000. Over here, this one's full because it had all day to, and night to do that. All right. We're ready to fire it up. And as long as this fuel maintains, we're in good shape. Are you ready? I hope so because I'm like, I'm about to do it right now. Okay. Here we go. Big boom. Boosh. There it is. We now have a running mechanism reactor. It is still increasing. That's what I wanted to check. So if it's increasing, that means I'm still making deuterium faster than the machine is using it. Only by a little. But it will continue to build up, and that'll be fine. So there we go, working mechanism reactor. <clears throat> it's power already working on the back. We've already got that set. Shunk. Lots of power just there. Good sauce. So, yeah. Nice. I'll leave these things as they are, just in case we need to use them later. But uh, I feel that it should be up and running to good now. Which is good, because that's going to help us power kicking down our fusion reactors. Delicious. Pretty sure the mechanism puts out more power than this. In its current state. If I was to jack up more corners and stuff, you know. I could do that. <clears throat> We've run into problems with disabling the limit before. Disabling the limit before has been a problem. I don't like to do that. I'm going to let these charge back up to full just on the off chance something happens and we need to re-kick it off and on. That way that we don't have to wait an hour for the power to fill up. Once that's full, um, it'll stop projecting power and we'll be good. So I'm going to let that go. <clears throat> All right. <clears throat> there we go. Check that out. Two reactors. That one wasn't even worth achievements. That one's just worth all the juices. All right. Um, and I'm, and I'm, and I'm, and I'm. Let's take a look at a couple of these statues. Let's get some of these out of the way. And then we'll start to tackle the Mahama Majama over here, which is the two, not one, two fusion reactors we're going to put together. 
<clears throat> okay. So, really, we're, we're really getting close. All the peaceful statues, except for all the colored sheep and rabbits, because that would be silly. So we have to make all the peaceful. Now that gets complicated. I'll talk to you why. Peaceful statues. <clears throat> to make those, you have to have the functional statue. Which, to make that, you have to have the sound white sheep statue. And to have that, you have to have the decorative white sheep statue. Then you can make a statue. <clears throat> so you got to make a statue, and then you got to bump it up five times. And that's not that hard for all of them except for the rabbit. I remember the rabbit being a turd. But he wants me to make all the peaceful. This is all the peaceful. Statue cores. Do I have a statue cores? I think I made some statue cores. Core. Mm, I don't have any statue cores. That's strange. I could have sworn I had some. Maybe I have to put in a statue. Well, I did, but it still didn't help. <laughs> statue cores. All right. Easiest way to get those is from Deep Mob Learning. Uh, we will use... Let me see. I get three from a witch. So let's do witch. Of which I have 360. Which will be more than enough. That. Uh, that. One stack. Okay, I'll just. I'm just gonna put like two stacks in there, because that's 124 times three. I mean, that's way more statues than there are. So there's the statue cores. That part's done. Um, let's go to statue again. Okay. Now you're being a turd. Statue. So, uh, you're, I'm going to need a bunch of redstone blocks. I got those. I'm going to need a bunch of note blocks. So let's make a whole bunch of those so that way we know we've got it. Okay, that's all the wood I had. So I guess that's how many we're going to make. I don't have a folder for those, I don't believe. So let's go ahead and get that done. I left the door open coming back from the nether. Like I'm raised in a barn. Insane. <clears throat> okay. So we're going to do it backwards. I'm going to start at the top, making my way across, going back. Because there are statues that don't have a peaceful version. I'm not going to mess with those ones. We're just doing the peaceful statues. So we're going to start with the zombie. So I need that, that, that. There's a zombie statue. That, that. Now he's a zombie. That's, that's tier two zombie. That will be tier three. Wait, what am I missing from tier three? Oh, I need nether quartz ore. Ooh. Okay. I can make it pretty easily, but I just, I'd forgotten about that. Huh. Quartz ore. We've got plenty. Where's that machine? There it is. Oh. Why will you not take my quartz ore? Why are you being like that? You grab some cobble and maybe it'll work. Cobble, 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 cobble. Cobblestone? Yes. Quartz. Why you no work? Combiner. Compressor. Oh, wrong machine. Uh, oh, there it is. Okay, I'd taken it out to put in a different one. Okay, we're good there. Uh, infusing factor. Are you done? You're done. <clears throat> there we go. No, no, no lithium. That, no. Either. Why is this not working for me? Just did not want to auto-load for some reason. Like, it won't let me... Shift, right, click it in. And it only did one. What is wrong with this machine? Oh, auto eject is off. It also did not matter. It's already got all the upgrades. All right, we'll try it this way. Maybe just pick it up and putting it down did something wrong. Come on, get in there. Okay. Still not working. Turn that on. Yes. Yep. I don't even begin to understand why that's working that way. 
Okay, well, that's annoying me. Let's go see if we can just get some. Little statue, you come with me. I cleaned out and manually did a bunch of the stuff in here today where it was backing up. So we may not have any in here to do, which could become a problem. I may have already gotten rid of it all. Oh, none in here. That's not a good sign. Chest. Empty. Nope, I drained it. <laughs> that figures. Oh, all right, we're going to go to the nether, I guess. That's just the fastest way to do it. Since that machine won't work. That's frustrating. I don't know why the machine's not working. It's not my fault. You're blaming me. Don't blame Draven. All right, we got our shrinky dink here. Uh, there it is. The shrinky dink goes up there. All right, we'll go to the nether real quick. And we'll get some. As I said, I was already over here mining some, so. Grab that. Grab that. Ow! Fire. Burns my butt. It's okay, though. Doesn't really do that much damage. Yee-hee! Why did that hurt when I pushed down? It hurt me more to push down. I'm going to burn again. Did I get it? I got it. Ha, ha, ha. Success. Some more quartz. No, I didn't mean to do that. Whoops. Should have brought my backpack. Bring a netherrack, which I'll use later. I mean, that's still okay. Just not what I wanted. Ooh. Got it. Let's see. There's some... Oh, no! Oh, I just threw my Silk Touch pickaxe in the lava. Oh, that's infuriating. <laughs> okay, well... That's not going to be enough quartz to get started, but... How many do I get? Oh, I don't even have two stacks. That's probably not going to be enough, but we'll... We'll go as far as we can with it. <clears throat> Put all those in there, those in there, those in there, those in there. Go back to peaceful. Oh, yeah, I got a little bit in there as well from... See, all the ones I made aren't in there, right? 108 is about what I brought back. Why is this no work? <clears throat> I honestly don't know. None, none, yes. Items config is on. Eject out the right. Input from the left. That's correct. Has it got power? It's got power. Ugh, I guess I could make a regular tier one combiner. It'd be slow, but it might be f still faster than mining it. We'll see when we get there. Zombies. With that one. And then a peaceful. All right. There's our first peaceful. Now we'll do the Baby Blaze. Which, again, this isn't going to hopefully take too long. Baby Blaze. Baby Blaze. Baby Blaze. There we go. Check it in! Should have eggs. I do. I think it's just going to pull it in if I do that. Chicken... Chicken. Chicken. Uh, is this the amount of quartz needed to make it, or is it more than was splitting it because it's it, of the auto split? No, it's not making it at all, is the thing. Like, because I, I had the auto split off and it still froze. Like, clear all that out, turn the auto split off. We've got some right there. So I won't even do that. If I, I can put one in, it's still not working. I don't know why. Not had that problem. I've used this machine before. So I again I wait. No, that didn't matter. <laughs> just on a whim. Yeah, just being a turd. I don't know why. I don't know if I've ever used it for that function before, but that's okay. We got three peacefuls already. We're actually gonna burn through this stuff. It'll be great. I already had the milk too. Excellent. 
that one, and that one, and Moo Juice, toot, toot, toot. Creeper, Creeper, one more Creeper, fool me, peaceful Creeper. How much the recipe call for? It's going to be four per statue. So we got three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve by four, forty-eight, forty-nine, fifty, one, two, three, four, fifty-four, <laughs> forty-eight, fifty-one, two, three, four, fifty-six times four. So what are we looking at? Two hundred and sixteen. Don't hold me to that, which I don't have enough for, but I've got enough to get started. So we'll get in. I'm sure I'm going to be missing other things as well, and I think I'm about to hit one of them. See, look, I can't make that. I don't think... Some of these are not included in the achievement. Because you can't get the base mod of this thing. I can't get the decorative fl flood statue. So we're going to skip that one. I can't get the decorative king statue. Mushroom I can get. Uh, again, not all of them are in there, oddly enough. So it's, it's just hard to know which one. Because the achievement does not have them listed. Because I don't have to make them all, I may end up having enough. Piggy! Piggy, piggy, piggy. Don't! I thought that was going to be a problem. Uh, it's uh, carrots. Okay. Carrots. For Draven. Oh, the salesman's back, I just realized. Uh, pork chops. Give me a bunch. Eight. That's enough. Throw those in there. Pretty, 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 pretty. Decorated piggy. Toot, toot. Piggy. There's actually another tier to each of these statues. You can go one further, but it doesn't require that for the achievement. So we're stopping where it says. All right, rabbits. We're coming back to rabbits. Rabbits are a nightmare. I don't even know if I can make the shaven sheep. Oh, maybe I can. No, I can't. What do I need for the regular sheep? Whoops, I went too far. Just wool. Okay. I feel like I could make the, sh the shaven sheep. We should make it because I can. So I need mutton, which is wheat. Get ourselves a stack of wheat. And mutton, that, that, yes. Go back to peaceful. Shaved piggy again. If I may end up making a couple that aren't required for the achievement, but that's okay. Whoops. Toot, toot. Toot. And toot. All right, there's the shaved one. There's the woolly one. I don't have to make the other colors. I only have to have the base color. I already made that one. So there's both of the sheeps. So yeah, you think about it, we knock out the sheeps and most of the rabbits. I'm not going to need anywhere near as many as I was thinking there. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Okay, I can make a slime. 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 We may have enough of everything, yeah, because that, that eliminating all those sheeps is going to make a big difference. Uh, do I have that? I do not. How does one make snow? I have that. Delicious. Snowman. That. That. There's the snowman. Squiddy! There should be a walrus. We've been robbed of the opportunity of joy in our lives for not having a walrus statue. I mean, I have the walrus statue. It's not the same. Peace whip trades in the future. Yeah, you see, you can't detective villager, decorative villager. Oh, okay, I can make it with that one. Okay. I need a functioner, functional village statue, sound villager statue, decorative villager statue. Okay, there's that guy. Sounder. Okay, that's right, that's right. All right, we're getting there. One of these. Yes. Delicious. We got it. Cool. 
I don't know if I have to make all the colors. But we will try to... We will make a witch. Because that's cool. Which We're going to get back to reactors in a minute, I promise. The technical stuff. I know this isn't as exciting. But it's still an achievement. And you told me to get them all. This is all your fault. Big ol' Zomber. Took a nap before the stream today. Boy, did I have some weirdo dreams today. No, I'm not going to share them with you. Uh, nothing inappropriate. I just don't remember them. I just remember waking up disturbed. And I don't mean I woke up the band disturbed. I woke up mentally disturbed. Peaceful Shulker. <clears throat> Delicious. I mean, I don't know if a shulker is delicious or not. I've never eaten one. Uh, but at least I know they're relatively fresh. They come in a can. Uh, peaceful Chicken Jockey. Uh, can't make that one. Magma. What we do? Rabbit's going to be last. There's that one. We're, we're so close to done already. I don't know what that guardian is going to need. There's that one. Cool. Oops, my phone's not muted. Sorry. Weird noises popping up out of nowhere. You're like, Draven, I'm hearing sounds. What in the world are you doing? That one's done. Enderman! Peaceful Enderman. Okay. Blowfish. Luckily, I have some blowfishes. Which I know that fishes is not the plural. I just like to say that one. What? I ran out of nether stars. I see. I will need wither matter. I did not. What? Pristine wither matter. Is that wither? Yeah, that's wither. Give me those wither matter. No, not that one. I hate when they wiggle around. Stay in the spot I put you in, dang it. Doot. Wither nether stars. I'm gonna have to get wither model going again. I used a bunch of supremium too. Wither. Make some more of that stuff. Uh, peaceful. Where were we? We were doing the fishy, right? Yes. Fishy. There we go. Peaceful fishy. I don't... There is no recipe for the one with sunglasses. Wasteland pig. Can't make that one. This is going to be a hard one. Hello, Night Axe. No! Okay. I forget. How do I get a totem of undying? This is one of the ones where it doesn't say there's a way to do it, but there is a way to do it. we got to come back to that one. I don't remember how to get those. Statue. Statue. All right, there's the spider. I think. There he is. And I don't think you can make this one. You cannot. Okay. So I need to make the evoker and a rabbit to have them all. Uh, so there's an achievement to get all the statues. And so as I have been tasked to get all of the statues, we are working on those. I'm just going to start putting them down, and then I'll add more as we need them. There's a cow. There's a creeper. Mushroom. Piggity. Sheepy. Other sheepity. I don't care to put them out of order. I'm just slapping them in here. Slap it a base. That one, that one, that one, that one is that one, that one, that one. All right, so there's that. What I got? I got three more plus a sheep at least. So we'll go one, two, three, four. One, two, three. I like the spider. It's one of my favorites because he, he actually pops up on your screen. I don't know if you saw that or not. Let me show you. When you hold it in your hand, see he's up in the right-hand corner? 
he's actually on my screen. It's hilarious. If you back out and you don't have a helmet on, he's just still in your hand. But he's on your face, and that's cool. I put him in the wrong spot, but that'll be fine. All right, so we need a rabbit. We have to find the first rabbit. That's that's the hard part. Because I only need one. But the recipe for every rabbit is one of the other rabbits. You just It's a matter of going through and finding out which one of the rabbits actually gives you the recipe for the rabbit you need. That one, that one, that one. There it is. No! What did I run out of? I needed... Oh, rabbit hide. Okay. Rabbit hide I get for carrots. Okay. Should be able to do that. Rabbit hide. That'll be enough because we only have to make one. I think it was the third one. Yes, it was. Rabbit. We did have enough quartz. That's excellent. Okay, I still have not got the achievement. So we're missing one, at least. Oh, right, we gotta make the uh, evoker. Evoker, we forgot, I forgot the evoker. I mean, two more in here, just in case. All right. How do we get the evoker? Mm. Problem is, I don't remember where to get a Tome of Undying. And the only recipe it gives me Oh, wait, I could do it from Loot Fabricator. That's what it is. Witch Matter. Okay. Witch ma I just used some Witch Matter. That works out well for me. Um, witch. Old Witch. The Wicked Witch. We'll do four. Let's uh, bust in there and get rid of that. There's no evoker in there, you liar. They lied to me. You can just make seeds and kill them, but, you know. Oh, that just gave me cores. I'm going to have to make seeds and kill them. That's exactly what's going to have to happen. I'm going to have to kill some. Now I remember. Until one of them... I need two statues. Right. So be it. What am I looking for? Bone meal. They're going to get bone meal and a beating. Stop that. There's one. There's two. Not as hard as I would have thought. <laughs> Convenience. Take apart bench. That's this one. Take those apart. Put in our evoker stuffs. And we go back to peaceful. And hopefully this will be the last one. Toot, toot, toot. Decorative fence. Come on, have enough. Whoops, missed one. I did. Still didn't get the achievement. Okay. All right. Um... What am I missing? <clears throat> Zombie. Blaze. Chicken and cow. Creeper and this thing. But there is no recipe to be able to get the decorative flood statue. Chicken king we got. Mushroom we got. Wait, do we have chicken king? We don't have chicken king. Can I make chicken king? No, there's no recipe for that. Mushroom, pig, and a rabbit. We've got that. A mushroom, pig, and then a rabbit we just made. He's over there. Uh, a sheep. We have both a shaved and unshaved version. Slime, snowman, squid. Slime, snowman, squid. Uh, peaceful villager statue. Oh, does it want all of those? I wonder if... I don't remember making all of the villagers before, though. Let's take a look at it. That's not the button. 
Oh, peaceful white rabbit statue. That's the one I'm missing. Oh, that, once you get a few, it tells you. That's excellent. White rabbit. Peaceful rabbit, rabbit. Oh, they're all just rabbits, but I need the white one. So I have to make a regular rabbit. Oh, I got to do it in the crafting thing here. All right, cool. Now I have to turn it into the white one. But I can't tell if that's white or gray. That looks gray to me. But that one also looks gray. I don't know how to tell. All right, I'm using the second one, which I think is gray. Which I, mean, which I think is white. So we'll see. Boop. There's the sound rabbit. That's the third tier rabbit. I've run out of cores. Of course I have. Dang it, witches. Oh, it's because they're all in there. Okay. That 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 solves problems. Boop. Peaceful. Uh, I was making that guy. There it is! <laughs> Hall of Fame! Excellent! We have made all of the peaceful statues. And that one just gave me some powder. If I pick it up. Pick it up. Yay. So the, the statues, you can click on them. And they will give you things. There is a cooldown. That one's usually gunpowder. What does the mushroom give me? They don't always give you something. That one didn't. Pig. I just got an oink out of the pig. Slime. Blowfish. Oh, I got a blowfish. Okay. You can automate them for supplies. I do have a tutorial that shows how to do that. If you ever wanted to know, it does exist. All right. Not too shabby. That is another achievement knocked out today, which is pretty cute. But that just leaves us the chunker achievements, doesn't it? This one I've got to work on. That's the last one we're going to do. This one I've got to work on. And by work on, it means I just have to manually farm the stuff and put it in there. Uh, huh. Which is possible, which I'm going to do. Um, and then go big or go home. That's where we're working at. We need to make the maximum size fusion reactor. I'm going to make two fusion reactors. I'm going to build them both at the same time a small one and a large one because I need the fuel or the materials produced by the first one to be the fuel for the second one the bigger one so we're going to have to I'm going to make the small one and the large one then fire the small one up and hopefully get it working now because I do not want to deal with the meltdown, we're going to do a quick reconnaissance of what they should be set up for. I'm actually going to exit out of the game and go back into a previous playthrough and make sure I'm looking at the I'm using the right fuels. All right, so we're going to do a quick step out. For those of you who never saw some of my previous playthroughs, you can get a glance at one real quick. You're going to see the very first one that ever worked. The first time I ever got this achievement. I'm also going to pour me some chocolatey milk. Delicious. This was my Sky Grids playthrough. Another type of world type for Sky Factory 4. Boop. Got this pack of straws. Every other straw's got a hole in it. It's infuriating. Let me rephrase. Every straw has a hole in it. But it has an extra hole that the air is getting out. So this was Sky Grid. So Sky Grid is just a, wor a world of, of materials floating out there. It was a fun play type. But much like in many of the other play types, once you've started doing it, once you get the saplings and stuff done, it becomes just a regular playthrough. All right, so we're going to make a small one and a large one, just like we did over there. So let me... Here's my pad of paper. So to fuel the little one... You can hear the hum. I need liquid hydrogen and deuterium, and I'm going to need it in a much higher amount than we had before for the other one. Liquid hydrogen 
and deuterum. Alright, now, come on down here. That is going to produce as a side product helium negative 3. Which is, I believe, one of the few. No, it's. Yes, it's one of the fuels we need to run the chunker. This is the chunker. The chunker needs helium negative 3 and liquid hydrogen again. So we only have to make liquid hydrogen enough that it can produce for both. Okay. And then for a coolant, I have two, whoop, four, I think I only needed two on each side. Yep. And I'm using liquid diamond for my active fluid cooler. So all of those are down here. So we're going to take a look at how we're going to do this, right? So this machine is creating our deuterium and our tritium. That was for the other reactor, but that's okay. This is actually powering that one. So we need the deuterium. What happened to my fission reactor anyways? Didn't I build one? Maybe I didn't build a fission reactor in this one. I guess I didn't. Okay, so deuterium is coming from there. Liquid hydrogen is its own thing. Liquid hydrogen is its own little setup, which we're going to work on. Uh, we're not going to need quite as much power because we're going to use flux, which is going to make that run easier. But we need to run multiple of them to get enough hydrogen is the thing. So you need liquid hydrogen. Where's my coolant? Oh, there it is. Here you go. Black hole tank. So this is my molten diamond. Molten diamond, again, diamond farm being produced and liquefied. So that we're going to have to make that. We're going I can't even look inside of this. There's there's so much stuff going on. Do I have a remote? Oh, I do have a remote. Excellent. Uh, and I needed a shrinky dink. Just taking a glance so I can make sure I had one in my inventory already. I'm an idiot. Whew. I know this is a mess. This is a mess. <laughs> Granted, we're not going to have all the power tubes because we're going to use flux. I didn't use flux in that playthrough uh, very much. So I need an electrolyzer with heavy water making deuterium. The same thing as we were doing before, but it's not just making that. And I've got these ones up here. And I got more down here because this is a hard fuel to get going. Um, so this is getting my deuterium. It just doesn't produce a lot. So I may want to use, because I didn't use mystical agriculture much in this playthrough on purpose. And that's why I had to build this like this. But I think that we'll have a higher deuterium outpoint. If, oh yeah, I guess either way. That's the heavy water one. That's not even the mystical one. That wouldn't work. Yeah, yeah, I got to jam it that way. I think that instead of separating it, because I don't really need the other component, I don't believe. I just need the deuterium, but I have two black holes. What's this one have in it? Tritium. Why do I, why am I getting tritium? What was tritium for? And do I need it? What in the world was I using tritium for? That's my deuterium and my liquid hydrogen. That's the fuel I'm using for both. Right? Deuterium, liquid hydrogen, helium-3, and liquid hydrogen. Yes. And then this produces helium, which I don't need either. And then I need the liquid diamond farm. Yeah, I don't even know why I'm getting tritium. Was I using it up here? Is this a tritium farm? No. No, yeah, I was using the same process there. Yep, yeah, same thing over here we did over there. I did use flux some, it looks like. So that's right. I don't know why I have tritium. That frustrates me because, like, I don't want to not, uh, you know, work on tritium and then get in here and find out I needed tritium for something. Interesting. Okay. Well, now we know what we're doing. Approximately. Mm -hmm. Let's get back into our game. 
And by the way, buddy, thanks for coming by and hanging out with me today. I appreciate it. And helping me to hit 25,000 subscribers on the channel yesterday, which was most excellent. Thank you all for helping me hit that. Because uh, really, it took 25,000 of you to do it, right? I could sit here all day and nobody subscribe. It's not going to do me much. Whoop, there we go. All right, we're back. Give me one second. Currently at 25,021. Had another 11 since yesterday, I think. Cool. Tritium. Let's see if we can, you know, for the fun of it, see what we would use tritium for. It is a fuel. For option. Tritium with neutron. No, I wasn't doing any of that. It is a side effect of this. But I don't. That would give me a tritium lamp. Why would I want that? Helium-3. So let's see here. Hydrogen, liquid hydrogen, and tritium. Is tritium the fuel I was using in the first one? No, I was using deuterium. Was I not? I was. I was using deuterium. Okay. That's tritium. Deuterium and tritium. I wish they wouldn't cycle so fast. I wish I could, I could control that easier. Tritium, tritium, tritium. Tritium and molten lithium, molten lithium. I'm just not seeing that combination of hydrogen and deuterium. It looks like it's liquid hydrogen and tritium that I need. And why did I have deuterium? Because I could combine deuterium with tritium. Huh. I do need to make one of these. What do I need for that? Magnesium, blah, 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 blah. I can make that. That's not a problem. We chose the fuel on the second one. The most important... It was the most important look because that was how we got a certain amount of heat. So let's see. Helium. Did I spell helium? I did spell helium wrong. That's me. And I did it again. Helium 3. That's the first one I need. So we've got liquid hydrogen and deuterium. Okay. Yes. That's what I have. Liquid hydrogen and deuterium. We'll make helium three. That's that's why I did that combo. Okay. A tutorial shows us to use liquid tritium to fuel a fusion reactor, uh, and we did use that because that that is a combo. But we needed to get us because the different recipes will produce a different amount of um, power and temperature, and we had to get it to a certain point in order for it to work. This is why this one's the hardest. Making a small one's easy. It's getting the, the big one to hit the right number that's the problem. And so when we got when we were working out the maximum size one, we had to use different materials. And I needed liquid hydrogen and helium three to make liquid hydrogen and helium that's molten lithium. Where is that? Liquid hydrogen and helium three. There we go. That one gives us a 303 KRF per tick. This is one of the highest temperatures you could get. There was one, I think, that was higher, but it was like 10 steps to get the fuel for it. That's why we went with this one. Yeah, it's, it's possible. It's possible to make it the tritium, and then we ended up switching to something else to get it to work. So I just need the deuterium. So I just need the deuterium. What am I using in here? I use tritium for this one. Right. Okay. Maybe I was making the tritium for the for the fiction friction or something. Deuterium. This is how you make deuterium. I just need a lot of it. So we gotta build a bunch of these set up. And a compact machine is usually the easiest way to do it. Um, so we're gonna do that. And then I need liquid diamonds. And then the... Du I 
still think this is faster deuterium this way because I don't need the oxygen. I can just eliminate that. So I think we're going to do that. We're going to build a bunch of these and have the deuterium flow out into a tank. Wait a minute. I have a problem. How was I sending it out? Because it's a gas, right? But I had it going into black hole tanks. How could I have the deuterium going into a black hole tank if it's a gas? Black hole tanks are only for liquids, are they not? Maybe it does gas. Let's find out. Hell, I don't know. If this does gas too, then I'll be pleasantly pleased. Well, it won't connect to that. Okay. Um, no, it would have to be a fluid. Because that's the only way I could get it out of the system. There is no... Because I was using cyclic. Man, I'm going to have to go back to that other one again. Sorry, guys. Again, this is a... I hate doing this achievement. It's just so hard. Um, it was coming out as a liquid. It's the only way I would have been able to use a liquid cable to get it out. Unless a liquid cable does gas. But I don't think it does. I think we've run into that before. Right? Because it's coming out as purple deuterium. Oh, it's a different deuterium. Okay. That's my liquid diamond. That's my deuterium. That's my liquid hydrogen. Liquid hydrogen, liquid, obviously. But I'm using a liquid deuterium not the red one. That's where I mixed up yesterday when I started to try to use the purple one on the other reactor. When in reality, I need the purple one. Gotcha. Back to the past. This was a fun playthrough. I always try to design the world slightly different. Uh, this, this one was a pretty cool achievement because not only was it the first time I got this achievement... For the maximum size reactor. It's also the first time I ever made the mechanism reactor. And I made an air cooled and a water cooled. I tried to anyways. But uh, yeah, we got we got these set up for the first time. Which was pretty boss. Yee -hee. Um, I didn't go after heads in this one. I only ended up having a few. So that's what, that's the key then. I need liquid deuterium, not the gas deuterium. And then liquid there. Yeah, so I'm using all liquids. So that's an important key to remember. I'm using all liquids. Okay, cuckoo. Cool, cool. That's the only laser drill I had. <laughs> so I didn't really do mystical. I was trying to do it without mystical. I ran mostly off saplings. I didn't really have that big... The world went down more than anything else. Right? There was my... One of our earlier inductions. That one's full. We got different GPSs running power. Did I have something underneath of this? Nope. That's as far as it went. But that's where I made my compact machine. So this one was a lot about trying to make things compact, to use multiple areas for multiple things. But we always had a clipboard. Very important. And over here I made brine and all that stuff. Okay. Alright. We're good now. Now I know. Now I know. I need liquids. That's where I was messing up. Groovy. Blinded me with science. Me, 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 me. All you boys pop up first. <laughs> it is kind of cool. Like it, That's cool 99% of the time until I can't figure something out and I try to find out how and my tutorials pop up. And then I'm like, well, I obviously knew how to do it. Why don't I know how to do it now? <laughs> I'm an idiot. I've lost the touch. <laughs> All right. We're going to need some compact machines. Let's get dangerous. 
Name the cartoon from which that was from. Oh, we already have one. Made it yesterday, didn't use it. Nice. I'm going to need emerald blocks. Just a couple. I'm only going to make like three or four of these. And some pearls. I know I'm going to need one for the deuterium, one for the liquid hydrogen, and one for the diamond. So we're going to need three. And I already got one, so I really only need to make two more. Cha cha cha. Boop. Anybody have any games that they know are coming out this year that they're very excited for? Let's get down. I went to Mulan. No. no. Let's get dangerous. I'll give you a hint. It is from a cartoon, though. Though not a full length feature. One, two, three, four. Yes. Okay. I think I missed one. I did. Where's my pearls? Boop. There we go. GTA 6. Oh, that's not coming out this year. <laughs> that will not be out in 2024. You're on the right lines there, Thorsh. It's actually from Darkwing Duck. That was Darkwing Duck's catchphrase. Let's get dangerous. Again, as we've mentioned, you can't have anything in the way when you're starting a new shrink. But once it starts to shrink, you can start building. Except for right now, because that's floating in my way. Thank you. Still. All right, this should be the last one we actually need, since I already had one. So, I think we're probably going to do the fuel. We're going to do deuterium first. Because it's the slowest producing of the three. And that will give it plenty of time to build up some while we're working on the liquid hydrogen. And then the last one will be the diamond. Because oh. while I'm doing the diamond, it gives more time for all the other fuels to build up, right? And then when we start the actual first one... Oh my goodness. Oh, one second. My allergies are kicking me today. My eyes just got all funky. Ugh. Um, once we get the small one going, we got to let it build up a little helium-3 before we can do much with it either. So, Oops. That's okay. I needed to go up there anyways. So it, that may be when we uh, take some time to just do a little bit of uh, building of stuff. Got all that moon juice I want to build with. So that should be the last one of these I need. So I can put this away. That away, that away, that away. I am going to need some more black hole tanks. Of which it would appear I already have four. That's not bad. Destiny 2. Been burned in the past. I don't... I apologize, Thorsh. I don't know what you mean by that. Make a few black hole tanks, because we're going to need them. Boy, did it take forever. I thought Destiny 2 is already out. Hasn't Destiny 2 been out for years? I think I own it, and I've never played it. I'm opening some crackers. I, uh... Yeah, I'm almost positive I've owned Destiny 2 for years, and never once even downloaded it to my computer. My friend Mary plays it a lot, though. Shadowcast, who does all my channel art. She was really into Destiny 2 for a while.
Okay, Tyler, I'm very confused by what you're saying. I'm going to be honest with you. I don't know why I went out there. I'm going to build it in here. All right. Yeah, Destiny 2 came out in 2017. It's been out for a long time. Heard good things, though. All right. I'm going to need a compact machine. I'm going to come back for these black hole units. I only need one for the deuterium. I'm not going to mess with the tritanium. So let's look at deuterium. Is this that's DT2 fuel? I don't need that anymore. And let's grab deuterium. And I want the purple one. That's hydrogen deuterium. And I want liquid hydrogen. Ooh, moon juice. Oh, is it DLC? Is that what it is? Oh, DLC. That's understandable. That's a little different. Hydrogen, liquid hydrogen. Okay, it's liquid hydrogen. And then we need liquid diamond. Why are you not showing it to me? I was pretty sure we used diamond. Yes. Molten. It's molten diamond. That was my bad. Okay, so that's the three things that we're looking at. Okay. 50-50. Deuterium is 950. So I get way more deuterium from using heavy water. Makes sense. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. So we want to use heavy water and electrolyzers. I'm not paralyzed. I seem to be struck by you. <laughs> wow, I could make one. That was not good. Schmump. 17. Okay, we'll make that many. No, we won't. I'm out of these copper nuggets. I always run out of copper nugs. Let's make a bunch of these. And again, four. Now what did I run out of? Oh, these. Boy, am I going to end up making a lot of this stuff. 18. All right, 18 is a start. It means I'm going to need 18 pumps. Think we can make 18? Well, they don't stack, so that's not good. Three, four, five, six... 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. Okay, good. Which means we're going to need heavy water filters for all of them. We have made that mistake in the past. Two, oh, they don't stack either. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Okay. Let's see, we're going to have to use the backpack here. So I'm taking all these in a compact machine, so I need them ready to go. That in there as well for now. I said, what, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. Put those in there. I'm going to need flux like it's no man's business. Flux. Fluckety flux. Flux points. I'm going to need... I really don't need 18 of these. I can connect some of these with power cables. So we'll we'll make a few. One, two, three. Okay, we'll make two. We'll make two. <laughs> what am I out of? Obsidian? Oh, we used all of our obsidian yesterday. I forgot about that. Pooptacular. Okay. Buckets. Let's make ourselves a new insanium bucket. Let's... Not make us an insane bucket? I could have sworn I had those. Oh, okay, there we go. Insane bucket. Sploosh. Mm. Yes, sir. Yeah, I put that in there because I didn't have any room in my inventory to put the backpack. But thank you. 
One of the weapons from the April update. 63. I don't know why it says the bucket holds 64. I never get more than 63 in it. Here are my input on GTA 6. Okay. Currently, I don't have any. I mean, I saw the trailer. That's all I know about it. Why are you giving me lava? I didn't want that. Okay, that's good enough. It's enough to get us started. What was I making? Pumps. No, I made pumps. What was I making? What in the world was I making that I needed obsidian for? Flux. Aha, it was flux. I remember now. Whew. Woo. Having a day. Having a day. There we go. Now I ran out of something else. That's fine. All right. And now I can do this. One, two, three, four, five. We'll do six of those. We'll go in and we'll do cables. There's some power cables. Some power cables. Can we make some more power cables? Good. I'm going to need... Fluid is where the big pajamas are going to go. I need a lot of fluid cables. Okay, that should work. All right. That should be a start. Shrinky dink. I don't need the bucket of lava. I will need a bucket of water. I didn't think about that. Bucket of water. Uh, Supremium bucket of water. Excellent. We'll go fill that up. And I'm going to need a bunch of brick. Uh, brick, 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 and gadgets. Building it. Delicious. Fill her up. Oh, it won't let me go because I haven't hit it with this yet. Okay. What's... Uh, so, uh, Tyler, I'm going to get your second question. I'm going to keep working on your first. I'm interested to see GTA. Here's the problem. The biggest issue I ran into for GTA. And this is the issue I run into for a lot of games. I prefer to play games by myself 99% of the time. Uh, so games that are so heavily skewed that you have to play in groups, and all the early heists in GTA V, all that stuff, you had to be in groups. I just played in a solo server, running around with my own criminal enterprises, earning money in cars and doing stuff for fun. I can play casually when I want. A lot of times when I'm playing games for fun... I have a, on my other monitor, I have a podcast up or a movie or a video or something. I can't do that if I have to talk to a bunch of people. That's the only time I get to actually watch any type of media, right? Because I can't watch media when I'm at work because I'm on a phone. I can't have sound on. So even if I'm working on projects, sound has to be all the way up. So I can't play games that require sound. The second issue is I have to pause a lot, whether it be phone calls, work, or whatever the case may be. Um, I can't do that when it's a multiplayer game. So I prefer most of the time to play games by myself. And I'm hoping GTA 6 gives more opportunity for that. Is my hope. Okie dokie. So, uh, I put brick down because we're going to have to have water underneath the pumps, right? And so that's kind of what I was thinking there. I'm... I'm I can now put water in there. I didn't want to put the whole ground water, right? Let me pull one of these out, and we said that was in here. I'm going to need these. I may have to make more of these. I just got to figure out how I'm going to line it up. So let's see. If I put this machine down, I'm going to have power coming up from the bottom. It's going to be pulling liquids out on one side, and all the other ones are going to get trashed. So I only have to pull fluid out on one side. This is all going to be better. Last time I had my own power sources in here. I'm not messing with that this time. I'm looking for literally quantity of, of stuff. So I slap that guy against the back, right? How am I going to get the water into it, right? Can I put the water in the front is my question. Let's see. Input tank. Yes, I can. Input is in the front. Excellent. So we, Oh, God, I'm going to need a whole bunch of these guys. Don't let me forget I need a whole bunch of upgrades. 
So if GTA 6 is a bit more a bit more opportunity for solo playing, mind you, I want to play GTA Online solo. I don't like the story mode of GTA. I didn't enjoy what I did. I only got a short ways into it because I didn't like it, and I just pushed through until I could get to the to unlock online. The online stuff is what I wanted. So that on the on rare chance that I want to run races or run around with people, I can, but I'm not required to do everything. Um, now, as for your favorite Sky Factory 4 playthrough, hands down, that's going to be the first Project E I played through. We did a lot of fun stuff in that world. I built the maze. I had the big racetrack on the bottom. I had a spaceship. We built the food court, the haunted house, all that stuff. But my favorite part of that entire run was New Year's Eve. When we set up a big thing that exploded and changed for Happy New Year for 2003 to 2004. Uh, I got pretty lit that night. Uh, we made all the fancy foods we could think of to watch the year roll over, and we, we rang in the new year. Uh, and I remember that evening being one of my favorite experiences in Minecraft streams, was getting to do that. So that world uh, has always been a favorite for that memory, if nothing else. Okie doke. So this is going to go here. I'm, I'm just we're, we're, I'm figuring out my layout. That's going to go in there. Now, I got to figure out if deuterium goes out on the left or right. I believe it's going to be the right. We're going to get one of these things running to test it. So let's real quick, because I don't have any of the upgrades for almost any of this stuff yet. We're going to have to make all of that. This is not a fast process. As I mentioned before, this is going to be a... Uh, this is going to be a playthrough. This is the, this will be half the playthrough itself is getting this achievement. So let's pull that out. And I don't need any of those anymore. I already got the filter in there. So there's water. That. Okay. Now I got to give it power. I'm doing power on the bottom so I can flux this. I don't even think of driving. What the flux? Yes, I will always make that joke. Prepare yourselves. So that should be pulling water out, albeit very slowly. Yes, I don't have any of the upgrades, so these things are all going to be going slowly. And once there's enough here to make a fuel, I can see which this is, and then we got to work out the setup for it, and then I can start connecting pipes. Hello, Jan. Good day. Steven, uh, you could possibly set it with the pump directly under the electrolyzer. That way you could do a fun row of them. You could, but I still have to have power going somewhere. And I got to power both of them. So this was just an easy way to power them both on flux. And then I'm going to run power cables along the back. And then I'll have another row here with the power cables going along the back because it won't be running into anything. All the fluids will be coming out the sides. And they're going to come down this direction to a black hole, which is going to feed out is my thought process anyways. We're going to see. Once I get some deuterium in there to test it. I have to have a thousand, I believe, before it will actually make a thing. So I probably should go out and get some upgrades for testing. But we're almost there. I'm just waiting, waiting for it to click over to a thousand. But I'm going to have rows. I'm just going to have power rows. And then the water goes this direction. Come here. There's a thousand. All right. Should be working now. Okay, we're going to go get some upgrades. <laughs> that is way too slow. All right, I'm going to set myself up in this corner. That is not the machine I thought it was. I'm going to set myself up in this corner. Let's go get some upgrades. I'm not paralyzed, but I seem to be struck by you. Also, don't forget, if you're out there watching and you're having a good time, please remember to click that like button. Helps out whole bunches of bunches. And even more so, please remember to subscribe if you haven't already so you can hang out with us more often. Because that would be cool. Upgrades. Got a stack of those. No, oh, I just grabbed two stacks of the same thing. Stack of each of those. And let me grab eight of these. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Gotcha. Okay, so 
Uh, Minecraft experience. What is your worst Minecraft experience ever? I have two words for you. Although technically they might have been pressed together. So it might be one long word. And I'm going to say it. But for those of you who have been with the channel for the longest, I think Teresa's out there. She might be the only one who knows, who remembers what the worst experience in Minecraft I ever had was. And it was a specific pack. It was the first pack I ever did that wasn't Sky Factory streaming. Who boy, did I not have fun with that. <laughs> ah, goodness. Uh, let's see. Let's put in the power ones, which aren't as important, but we'll get them in there just to be on the safe side. There it is. Steven remembers. Volcano block. God. I just hated that pack. Going back to it now, after everything else I've ever done, it might not be as bad. But it had so many of the things I dislike in packs. Like when it took processes and made them harder for no reason without benefit, which is something I talk about all the time, right? I just don't like that. There. Now it's working, finally. Tritium Deuterum. There it is. Deuterum. All right, so let's click on here. Deuterum. Output tank configuration. I feel like I want to have it coming out the left-hand side. So we're going to leave that. We don't want outputs going to any other spot. And then we're going to go to... So that was Deuterum. This one I don't want at all. Void S excess. So that's what I got to do on all the other ones. No, not that. Void excess. And there won't be any excess of the deuterium, deuterium, because that's going to have a pipe leading out. But the other ones are not. I just don't want them to be in the way. Okay, so if it's coming out the left, then technically, boop, it would be coming out here. And where's a black hole unit? Black hole unit. Did I only bring one? We're going to see if this works. And if it does, cool. Oh, oh, I did not bring a redstone torch to singe that. Going to have to get a redstone torch or I'm going to mess things up. You know, maybe that's what I'll do next, Stephen. Maybe Draven will make a triumphant return to Volcano Block after this playthrough. <laughs> uh, I may be looking at it with fresh... It'll have been seven years. Six or seven. Probably six years. Because I did play Sky Factory for quite a while at the beginning without doing anything else. Um, <laughs> that deck could definitely do it. Okay, so then I'm going to have... I'm going to do that. Technically, I would have some cables leading down, and then I'd have extraction cables in between. And then all of that would be plugging into a black hole unit at the very end that should be getting some deuterium, but is not. Deuterium is not exiting. Okay, why not? Output tank configuration. Left output. Yeah. That, uh... Why is it not coming out the left? Hmm. It's a fluid. It's in millibuckets. Need more chocolate milk. Why is this not working? Maybe I have to have it come out the right... I didn't think it mattered, though. I don't think that matters, but... We'll take a look. No. Hmm. So that's not it. It's got power. It's making it. I'm 
Void excess. Void excess. Ah, oh, void all. I don't want that. Void excess. Default. Maybe it has to be full? That would seem odd to me, but who knows? We'll give it a minute. It is, it's still not fast, but it's, it's working. Empty. No fluid. What do you mean, no fluid? There's water right there. Oh, yeah, still putting more in here, so it's working. Hmm. Why you no work? Why you make me so angry? I didn't do anything with the cable. It should be fine. Maybe it does have to be on the right-hand side. We will test that then. May oh, maybe that's not considered the front? I don't know. Okay. So it has to be on this side. Does that mean it considers this the left? Oh, the water's coming in the back? Let me test something. Oh, it's spun around. See, it doesn't have this design on it. Somehow it's spun around on me. I didn't mean to do all that, but, you know, it'll work. So if I now go like this and put in the things, I wasted all the water that was going into it. And that. No, I singed you all. Oh, God. Fortunately, there's no tank there to mess that up yet. Uh, Blort. Okay, singed it. That's good. That's what I wanted. And now we'll get that in here. Kershwink. I said kershwink. Don't unkershwink me when I kershwink. Darn it. Now this should be working. I'm going to have to go back in and recalibrate it again. Okay. This is my deuterium. I want it going out the left. That's what we had before. These ones, I want voiding excess. And it should not be going anywhere. See, I need to get a few of these up and going, and then I can always do more off-camera so you guys don't have to watch all this. That's the void excess. That's... Oh, get it again. Void excess. And then down here, I want void excess. Okay, now the deuterium should be going to the right spot now. If I put the tank on here, how much is in here? 23,750. 23,750, okay. It did spin around again. Huh. I mean, that's fine. I can make that work. If I mean, that's if that as long as it's consistent and it spins it around on me every time, I can make that work. It just means I didn't have to leave a space there, but it's fine. So I would just need to singe this side. Or I could avoid the singeing by going up a step. That would probably be easier. And then the next one I can have pumping up into that, and then I'll have the same thing coming down here, but into the end. Okay. All right. Okay. So, yeah, I guess the water only goes in the back from the, from the sounds of it. So, okay. That works. That works. It's been around backwards all day long. I'm okay with that. And then I need a power cable... I don't know how far that's going to go, but that's a start. Um, I'm going to 
singe the side of that because I don't want what I'm going to build next. To, I'm going to try to fit in as many as I can here. Not going to leave me a lot of room to maneuver, but if I can fit more on the base level than I did in the old one, then I may not have to have a second floor, which would be nice. So we got you, and we know you're going to spin around because you're a jerk. <laughs> and then we're going to do this again. Hold orc. And then we're going to do this again. All right, all right, all right, all right. So we got that, and then I need to get a pump going. Pump. And I didn't bring upgrades for this other machine yet, which is fine. I'm not in need of all of them. I just would like to get a row going so we can see how it's going to work. Then I'll go make a bajillion things. Speed upgrades and stuff. All right, so that's the filter. That'll make the water work. Uh, water and brick. Water, brick. And, oh, they already got power. Pushwa. That should be working. It is. So then I do the exact same thing. Go in here. You. Turn all these off. Void, oop, void excess. I keep doing that too many clicks. And then this is the one I want. I want it to stay on default. And I want it to go out. I had it on the left. So it's still on the left side. Where before I would have had a space on this side. But yeah. What do you mean? It didn't rotate. What? You're right. This one didn't spin around. Okay. So that means this time I need it coming out the right side. Wow. Okay, so inconsistency. I don't know what's going on with all that mojo. I don't know if the flux has something to do with it. Maybe the upgrades when they go in there. I'm not sure. I mean, I could have, but I don't care that much, to be honest. I know it's not that's a bad idea. It is. But, I mean, if it's just a matter of me clicking left or right, depending on which side it's facing, it's easier than me spinning it around a bunch of times. But, yeah, the crescent hammer might. Oh, no. Look. It did it again. It switched it. Well, I wasn't looking. <gasps> you know what it is? I think it's spinning it when it puts its first thing, when it completes a process. Maybe. Maybe not. I could be wrong. But now I gotta. Wait, what? It's left output. Well, that's. It changed itself there, too. It's not right anymore. Wow. Okay. So here's, here's what I'm thinking. Here's what I'm thinking is the issue. Is that. By default, these two are supposed to come out the right-hand side. So if I'm wanting it to come out the left, it's spinning it when it tries to put it out. I think that's what it is. I think if I'd have done these on right-hand side, all of them, maybe. No, because that one was on right and it changed it. Who knows? We'll just keep on trucking. <laughs> Inconsistencies. But we can still make them work. That's all that matters. So as long as we can get it going. So let me see. We got one. I, I'll be coming back to you, sir. One, one, one. So it's, again, 
I was going to end up with the space on one side or the other. So it's fine that the space is here. It just means there's no space on this end. So either way, all good, good, good. Hey, check this out. Has anybody ever done this? You know, if you hit the R button and you have extended storage, you can go ahead and pull stuff right out of your extended storage. I noticed this yesterday. I've never messed it or put stuff directly into it. And by extended storage, I mean, that's this. Hitting the R button opens it up and you can pull stuff out of your extended storage without having to go in your inventory to get it. Just an interesting little thing I came across by accident. Alright, so we're going to do that. Not two of them. Crazy. Do, do, do. Boot. <laughs> These aren't producing anything yet, so I'm not too worried about it. We'll get this fixed in time. Boot. Go a little bit more to the left. You gotta line it up. Well, maybe it would have been faster to do it at the right time. No? There it is. Don't need it on top. I need that to work. Alright. And the last one I don't have to because there's nothing going to be beside it. So that, 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 and that. So then I need to organize some of that a little bit. I'm not going to need those yet. I'm going to need four pumps. Oh, wrong one. It's going to be one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four. Switch those out real quick. So pump, 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 pump. Do, do, do. And I'll know I still need speeds and energy ones for all of these things. We're going to get this first row going, then I'm going to fill it up before we move on to the next row. I'm going to get a full row running. Polymer clay automation. It works, but not consistently. The simple storage? Okay, gotcha. All right, so let's go in here. And let's do this now. So this is going to be going out the left. Yes. Leaving out on default. That one is void excess and going nowhere. It could be so, this thing that I'm clicking right now. Doing this here could be messing it up. I don't know. Void excess. All right, so that's all those. We'll go over to this one. Same thing. This one's going to go left. No, left is right. Okay. I don't have a lot of games I'm excited about this year that I can think of that are coming out. Uh, well, I can't think of anything offhand that's coming out that I even am looking forward to a little bit. Um, again, not that I'm saying there's no good games out there. I just can't think of any that are on my excited for list. Um, all the games I'm excited about won't be coming out this year. <laughs> but they're like, they're just starting uh, Cyberpunk 2077 2. So they're just starting that process. So make sure I got these right. So I was chatting there for a minute. Yeah, I missed one. Um, so it's going to be a while on that. We're not going to see Subnautica 2 this year, they've already said. So we've got some time on that. Um, those are the only games I know of in production that I'm really stoked about. Okay. All right. Now I got to get the water in there. Oh, I got a fluid cables. Fluid cables. Whoops. You and you and you and you. And then I need bricks and bucket of water. Sims games. I did not. My wife played a couple of them, I want to say. But no, they didn't. They didn't. 
If there was active things you had to fight to survive, it'd be more along my lines. But uh, I don't play many games that have a, that are basically a peaceful mode. Not saying it's a bad game, it's just not the type of game I play. Never really intrigued me. My wife jammed them for a little while, though. All right. So all of those are going, and these ones will spin around in a minute once everything gets going. Um, I need to go get four sets of upgrades for this and this. And then we'll work on the next row. Or we'll let that build up, and I'll fill out the rest of them off camera. We might do that. I'm going to finish out this row and get it going. And then we'll switch over to setting up the next automation. So we'll try to get all three fuels started today. And then I can always flush them out to make them go faster and let them build up over the week. So we can start actually building the reactor next time. Vintage story. No, I can't say I've ever heard of that one. That one's not one I know. Okay, so we said four sets of upgrades. Okay. So I've got one, and I've got one. So there's one of those. So there's some leftovers. We're going to ignore those. So I need two, three, four. I ran out of something. What did I run out of? These guys again. Always running out of plates. That's why you use a bowl. Okay. Chicum, chicum, chicum. I'm making a few extra because I know I'm going to need them. But I'm only taking four with me. And then I'm going to need four power. Let's go ahead and make so we know we've got enough. One, two, three, four. Okay. So that's all of those. Let's drop those in here for now. I brought way too many bricks. That's part of my problem. Get rid of some of those. And then I need the upgrades for the pump. That's going to be actually. You don't have to make eight at a time. I don't know why I don't just click. It'd be way faster. And one, two, three, four. Okay, that's all of our upgrades. Okay, in we go. Oh, it is five sets. You're 100 percent correct. I didn't even think about that. All right, we'll go back out for the other ones in a minute. Uh, energy first. Energy. 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 I forgot we didn't have any for the second one. You were a million percent correct. Well, those are building in. Well, that just put one in. That's I hate that. Power. Oh, the other ones are still in the tank here. Okay. So, power. Speed. Power. Speed, power speed, power speed. Why do I have an extra power? Power and speed, power and speed, power and speed, power and speed. Okay, I just, I made an extra power one, so I just need the speed for that one. Okay, and then we need to put, oh, let me get back over here. Go in order before I forget. Speed, speed. 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 Okay, so there's those. And we'll jump back out again and grab the last th three stacks we need. Krishwink, come on, load up. There we go. And I needed an energy. I needed a speed. And then I needed a speed of this type. Everything will be in the end here. Uh, sp speed. Oh, I hate when that happens. That. The other one's already in there. Okay. So as soon as this pooper duper's out, yep, they've all spun around. So we know they're all <laughs> doing the jams. Deuterium is building up. It's still slow. Um, but we're going to have to let it, this get a good head start. Power. That'll make that one run better. Okay. Everything is running to its maximum speed. Everything appears to be doing okay. Hopefully everything is kicking out. We'll come back, and if I see any of these things are full and not working, I'll know there's a problem. See, that one is empty. 
empty. That one is not empty. Why is that one not empty? Because it switched to right for some reason. No, we want it on the left. Now it's working. See, it's, it's changing its own settings here. When it's spinning around. Okay. And then... Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, crap! Oh, no, the other one's... Oh, did it pull the other ones out? No, I did turn them all off. Okay. I'm not, I just got a fear that some of the other ones might be uh, stuck in the pipe. And uh, But that's we, we're avoiding all the other ones, so we should be okay there. I hope, because some of these are empty. Uh, so I need to fix this one. That one. That one. It's now this side. It's gone zero. And then this one. So it did it on all of them almost. Okay. That's okay, because all the other ones are set to void at excess. So we should be good. We'll just keep an eye on it. If we ever get back in here and it's full, that means somewhere in one of the pipes it's clogged. But hopefully we should be okay there. Now it's moving on all different sides. So, all right. So basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to make another row of these here, 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 here. And I might do a second level, to be honest. I may have to, just to make sure we have room. I mean, we have enough producing. And then this I'm going to feed out with a tunnel. I just haven't had to yet. I just, you know, I'll, I'll do that when we get there. As long as it's filling up in here, I can always pull it out later. So that's good. We've got our first one done. Let's uh, step back out. Our deuterum is le fini. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to break that now. And our reactors are going to be over here. So we're going to set this kind of in the middle. And then I can pull them out and have them go different places from there. Uh, let's see. So that's one. I should name this. How do you spell Deuteron? It's probably not right. Deuter. E um, I forgot the I. Okay, I wasn't that far off. I was all right. I'll oh, why'd you do that like that? I U M. There we go. That's good. Delicious. Deuterum. Wonderful. So that's started. One down. Now I'm going to throw all the rest of the components we have back in here temporarily so I can dig them out as I need them later. Because now that I'm in, I'll have to put them all back together, but that's fine. Um, let me switch these two because it's bugging me. And then we're going to need another compact machine because now we're going to work on liquid helium. Now, I'll be honest, I don't remember off the top of my head how you get that. So, uh, liquid hydrogen. Is it hydrogen? It's hydrogen. Liquid hydrogen. So, to get liquid hydrogen, I have to have regular hydrogen. Okay. To get regular hydrogen, it's an electrolytic separator. Really? That's it? Electrolytic separator is all I need to... I forgot. Well, that's actually going to be a pretty fast process then. Those are going to run pretty smooth. I am going to need some infinite water sources. So we're going to steal a couple. Because I, this is full. I don't need all of those in there now. They're being wasted. So I can come up here Grab those ones. And I'm going to grab this side too. Make sure none fell down. Nope, there's 14 of the maximum sized ones. Great. That'll be great. That's one bunch of things I don't have to make now. All right. Uh, this should produce faster than the deuterium, but I need this to run both reactors. So this has to produce twice as much. Um, so, pros and cons, right? So right off the bat, we're going to need some rotary condensators. Okay? I'm missing things from that. What am I missing? That's not it. Rotary condensator. Let's go ahead and add that up here. And I was missing tanks. Of course I was. Tanks, yes. And they don't stack either. Of course not. Uh, we'll start with... How many is that? Uh, nine, ten, and twelve. All right, we're making a dozen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 
this. The worst part is it's not going to pull that in every time. One, that, and that. Two, they don't stack either. Great. <laughs> two, one and two, one and two. I'm excited. Uh, this upcoming Saturday, um, my friends Ashley and Jim are going to come over to the house. It's the first time we've had them over in quite a while. We go out and do stuff several times, you know, like all the time. Go movies and things like that and have dinner. But we don't uh, we don't get together and just hang out at the house very much. We do a lot of remote hangouts over Discord, just. Or we'll play Jackbox and so on and so forth. But they're going to come over. We're going to hang out. We're going to play some Jackbox and I think some Cards Against Humanity. I got a bunch of new Cards Against Humanity packs for Christmas I haven't had a chance to use yet that I'm excited about. Which should be cool. Okay. I'm going to need speed upgrades for this as well. I'm going to need a lot of upgrades. We're going to come back and make those afterwards. Uh, so that's that machine. And then running into that... Wait, that's not we needed electrolytic separators. That's the next one. So I need 12 of these. Okie doke. 12 of these. I'm going to need to make 12 of these. And... Fwah! Okay, they don't stack either. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Okay, now we're going to put all these in here. Because I'm not going to probably need all of them right away. Um, let's see. Gonna need... These are all liquids, right? No, maybe. No, they're not. I'm gonna need tubes. Tubes. I'm out of tubes. There's a stack of tubes, because that's how I'm gonna have to run potentially the gas, maybe? I'm not sure. We are gonna need some cables, though. So, actually, let me... Did I have extra flux in here? I did. Let me bring some of the flux. We're gonna need that. Uh, cables, we're probably going to need a bunch of fluid again. Power, 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 fluid, 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 power. I don't need any water for this one, so I don't need to put bricks on the bottom layer. In case i got to singe anything, we'll bring that. <sighs> I think that's everything except upgrades. Oh, and a black hole unit. Black hole tank. There we go. Okay. Shrinky dink. Now, i got to figure out a layout. All right, we're going to set myself in this corner. I'm going to set that over there just so I remember what corner I'm synced in. All right, so we're going to go over here. Did I put all of them in there? I'm a fool. I should have kept out one of each for the workings. Now, I don't need a tube to combine these two machines. So I know that I'm just setting this down. This is going to go here. This is going to go here. And then the water block goes on the back of this. Yes. That's going to produce oxygen, and which is already feeding. And then the other one's already going in there for the hydrogen. Now, for this one, I'm going to put on dumping excess because I don't care about the oxygen. This is being turned into liquid hydrogen. And so then this is going to use a fluid, and then that's going to feed to a tank. Okay. So what I can do is I can push this. So it's going to take two for this. I think I know I'm going to do it. Okay. I should have brought some bricks, but I didn't. That's my fault. That's okay. We can use the water. We'll use... The water is going to go there. I'm going to put the power on the bottom. Electrolytic separator. Padap. And that's going to go to dumping excess. And then we said the electrolytic thing is going to go here. Then I'm going to take my flux. Put it here. And then I'll say, what's it going to say? What the flux? Because that's all I have in my life. Then I'm going to go like that. That's going to be wrong. <laughs> I picked that up. We're going to try it again. More accurate this time. There we go. So that's the power for that. And then this is going to be a liquid, which I, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go like this. 
and Zan to make the magic happen. I'm going to go like this. Um, I'm going to go up two this time. Because I don't want this to drop inside the... Liquid hydrogen. Already working. So I can do a row of those, and I can run a row here for power as well. So we're going to do the same thing each time. I could probably put the water here, and it won't hurt that, I would think. Nope, it doesn't. That's just me condensing right there. So let me grab power. Oh, I'll need another extraction cable. Put it on this side. And we're going to go with that, 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 that. And there. Did I run out of power? Okay, good. There. 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 And there. Okay, so I won't need one here. Ah! Mustache hair. Tickling my nose. Okay. All right. So I didn't end up needing tubes after all because these two machines can just connect. So that saves me having to use tubes. So then we would do the same thing here. This one's going to be way faster to set up. We'll grab one, two, three. How many did I say? One, two, three, four, five. So we're going to have the same amount of the other ones we did. Three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. We'll just have to go make the upgrades for them all. Uh, you? Oh, let's get the water in first, right? Water, 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 water. And then get you out of the way. Electric separators. Just going to be you and you and you. They've all got power. They've all got water. Let's dump in here. Dumping excess. Wait a minute. Is that right? Yeah. Dumping excess. Got thrown off for a minute. Ignore my wait a minute. For some reason, I got mixed up. Okay. So that's dumping all the excess. Let me go you. And we go you. And we go you. You, and we go you, and then I did not bring enough of these. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, I did. That's 50. I thought that was five. Okay. And the reason I'm doing this, I went up two. So if I only went up one, then I'd have to singe the bottom every time it crossed over the next one. Or it would feed in. I didn't want all that. I don't want mixing anything up here. Okay. Uh, so that's that. Then I got to run that here. Whoops. That is not correct, Draven. You fool! We're getting a lot of this prep work done today, which is nice. Then we actually have to get to building the physical contraptions next weekend. So next weekend, we'll 100% have the small one up and running. We may, honestly, have them both up and running. How crazy would that be? Really? One shy? You're going to hit me like that? Okay. Good deals. So that's everything I need there. I shouldn't have to singe anything. The spacing on that works really well. So, um, And then I'm going to run power cables this way as well to attach the rest of things, so I won't even need to use any other flux. In theory. In theory, mind you. I couldn't do that with the other one because the pumps were in the way. But that works. And that will start filling up liquid hydrogen. And now we just need six sets. No, 12 sets, because I need them for both machines. 
I need 12 sets of each upgrade. Uh, but I only need the mechanism ones. So that'll, that will still work. What happened here? Oh, I accidentally auto-sorted this. That was not something I normally do. Remote there. Yes. Okay. Accidentally auto-sorted down there. Okay. Let's go make ourselves some upgrades. Like I said, I'll finish filling this out this week and let all of these things build up. We still have to do the liquid diamond or the molten diamond. Isn't that interesting? Molten diamond is a coolant. That doesn't even make science. Okay. <laughs> okay, I don't need any of this stuff now. I'm going to put it away so I have more room for the upgrades. Upgrades. Now. For this one, I need 12, I said. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Okay, nice. I like the way that worked. Same for this one. One, two, three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Beauty! That worked out phenomenal, minimum, 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 minimum. I'm over here. Here I am. So, you power first. I always like to do power first, because if you don't, you put the speed in first, then it's going way too fast for the amount of power it's getting, and it gets all choky. And yes, I'm doing the second machine first. Power, power, by the time I get all the way to the end, the first one should be done, and I can start doing the speed ones. Power, power. I have been playing a ton of Days Gone. Very much enjoy the game. Uh, whenever I'm not playing Raid Shadow Legends, which is 99% of the time. Oh, my goodness. It reminds me, i got to click on something real quick. Hold on a minute. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. Signed in, signed in, signed in, signed in, signed in, signed in. Uh, and update. Sorry. Sorry. I got an email real quick. One second. Respond to that. Okay, sorry. Did my Raid Shadow Legends for the next hour, and we're good. <laughs> so now we do the speed. The need for speed. We're going to go in the same order to make sure that everyone's had a chance to get done. Start streaming Days Gone. I actually did. Uh, not so almost a month ago at this point, I guess. I did it over on Twitch. Because Twitch is where I stream non-Minecraft stuff. Uh, and I had a good time. And then last time... Last, uh, two Fridays ago, instead of Days Gone, we had a Jackbox night. Which was a lot of fun. I try to do a Jackbox night whenever possible. I try to squeeze it in once a month if I can do it. But there'll also be more opportunity for game night participation when I get the new Patreon stuff set up. So that'll be something else available. There'll still be game nights on here just like there was. And again, I, I stressed this yesterday. I'm going to stress it every time I bring it up. The amount of frequency and stuff that already comes with memberships and subs on Twitch is going to stay the same. In fact, they may even increase. Uh, no one's going to lose access to anything. I'm just going to be adding some additional things on top of that for people who wish to participate. Okay. Liquid hydrogen. Boy, that's a constant stream going, huh? That's way faster than the deuterium was going. Luckily, molten, molten diamond we don't even need a ton of. A little goes a long way with that one. That is going to be way faster. I'm probably not even going to need to fill this room. One, maybe two more rows is probably going to be enough. So, because it doesn't, the reactor doesn't go through it super, super fast. So, cray cray. Do I have anything in here I didn't use? Yes, I made a whole bunch more. I've got enough there. Put these in here. What's there, six of each? I could probably do one more row with those, and that might be all I need. All right. Oh, yeah, let's, uh, let's get that going where it goes. Okay, so that is liquid hydrogen. Hydrogen 3. Oh, I have no idea. <laughs> um, 
Hydrogen 3? Oh, wait a minute. Do you mean helium 3? Helium 3 is a byproduct of the reactor. Helium 3 is what I'm going to mix with liquid hydrogen in the large reactor. Uh, helium for the win. Okay. All right. Cool e cool. Boy, this is all messed up. I'll have to clean that out later. All right, that leaves us with the last one, which is Molten Diamond. Molten Diamond. So you can do it in a smeltery. We're not going to. You can do it in a melter. That's how we're going to do it. Now. I'm torn. Torn. Like an old sweater. Because there might be a faster way to do that. How many diamonds do I have? 60,000 diamonds. Let me ask. Would everyone agree that that's probably all the diamonds I'm going to need? For the rest of this playthrough, right? I just don't know how fast it'll produce. So, all the diamond acorns I have are gone. Um, see, it says I can run diamonds through this. It does not say I can run diamond amber. Oh, wait, here we go. Melter. That's what I was looking at. Diamond, diamond dust, diamond stuff, diamond things... Diamond Amber. Now that's normally what I do. I plant a whole bunch of diamond saplings. I put a, a, a compact, inside the compact machine, I build its own simple storage. So that way I can automate diamonds into Diamond Amber. But I'm wondering if I need to do all of that. But the problem is I only have one diamond sapling going on right now. And I have zero di diamond acorns. Because I could just set it up to automate diamonds amber just like I do over here. But then instead of having it go into the smeltery, I have it feed directly into a melter and wirelessly go to a black hole tank. I wouldn't even need the compact machine. It's just whether or not how fast one diamond is one diamond sapling going to be enough to provide what I need. And that's where I'm afraid it won't. I could plant a couple more diamond saplings outside. I still have some slots for... Sa uh, 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 stuck in the door. Stuck in the door. <laughs> I'm so fast. I got spots for two more, but I don't know if that's going to make that much of a difference. Hmm. I'm thinking. I'm doing brain math. Give me a moment. Trying to figure out exactly the best way to do this. That's all my chocolate milk, too. It's very depressing. See, I could, instead, just run resin into it. That's for the coolant. I'll be using fluid coolers. So, yeah, there's going to be... What is it? Uh, two in each corner. So we're looking at, and I, I, I think, the small one may not, I think only had one in each corner, technically. But the large one had eight total, two in each corner. So it's not a lot. So I'm thinking I could just run diamond resin through a melter. I could export diamond resin into a chest, have the chest feed into a melter, the melter go into a black hole tank, or I could have it just connected to a wireless fluid, and instead of a compact machine, I just have a black hole tank here filling up with liquid diamond. And over time, as acorns start to build up, I could always switch it to diamond amber if I wanted to. I feel like that would be a good idea. It would definitely be less building. 
Well, the, pro the well, the issue I have right now is that I don't have any acorns because I've been automating diamonds. So I don't have a buildup of diamond acorns, but I have 740,000 resin. If I had lots of diamonds, I would just automate diamond amber and get more bang for my buck. But I think I could just feed this diamond resin in and it would work. Let's try that first. Let's see what we can do with that. So I'm going to need an export cable. Boy, I can't spell for nothing. Storage export cable. Let's get that in there. I'm going to put that to five. That's the shrinky dink. Oh, goodness. Hiccups. Upgrades. One, two, three. And a stack upgrade. There's that. That. Yes. Then I need... I'm going to need a chest. Chest. That's working. Uh, then I have to pull that up. I'm going to need to singe it. Let me grab a torch. Torch. We're going to singe that just to be on the safe side. Then I'll need an item extraction cable. Which I only need one of those. That's going to pull there. And then I need a melter. Cool, we got one. Melter. I'm going to have to give it power, but we're going to get to that. Uh, flux. Take that back. I'm not going to waste a flux on that. Uh, energy, energy. Ow, fire! Oh, it's so hot. Okay. Gonna burn. Which one has my melter? That one. Beauty. There we go. And you already had one flux out there, so. Don't worry, the fire will go away in a minute. <clears throat> Somehow I ended up with an extra brick. Oh, from the back of the melter. Okay. All right, so the melter is doing its mojo. So we got that and that. Then I need upgrades for that machine, which is that and that. I don't have enough of those. Okay. Melter gets those two. Then I'm going to need a tank. I'm going to need... Actually, no, I need a wireless... Fluid. <laughs> okay. Don't have any blocks of gold, it turns out. Okay. Wireless fluid. Which is going to go there. No. Items. Now, I didn't even think that was possible. I don't think that that actually will do anything. But just to be on the safe side, we'll singe it. I don't think it'll matter, though. I don't think it can put items in a fluid. And then I'm going to need cable again, which will be a fluid, which I will do this. Hmm. Hmm. Take that back. Take that back. Just so I can use this space later. Set that up there. That'll solve that problem. Fluid... Doesn't tell me what it is, but okay. Transfer at full speed. I'm going to need a GPS. Uh, GPS. Oh, I have one there. Good. And then I'll need a black hole tank. Which I should have the other one we made. There it is. Oop, lag. Too fast. That... Go. 
Even though it showed up white over there, it's the right color here. Molten Diamond. And so that's just going to feed into that, and I think that should be good. Because, again, I'm going to let it run for the next week, and we're not even going to... We're not going to barely use it between now and then, so... What was that for? Oh, that's my TBU fuel. Okay. So that's good, and that still gives me... I really only... Technically, that only took one slot. That's way better than using an entire compact machine. You know what I mean? That gives us a compact machine for something else if we need it. Right, put it in there. No, not my backpack. Stop stealing my backpack. Ugh, put it over here. Junk. Well, where did it put my backpack? Well, there it is. Crazy. All right. So that said, we now have all three fuels producing. Now, normally what I'm going to do is I'm going to connect these to tunnels and have them going into black hole tanks. So we're going to do that now so that they're there. That way we can see how much is actually being made without having to go inside the machine every time. And then I'm going to need fluid cables. Let me a stack of those. Do I have any tunnels? Oh, I have. I already have tunnels. That's excellent. You... You, those are already maxed out. Boop. Oh, here we are. So I'm going to go ahead and put that there. So I want it facing up. Back. Cool. Step on out. Which, that was that one. Okay, good. Go back in this one. Same thing. Up. Go. All right. So there's liquid hydrogen. There's deuterium. And then this one's just already as it is. So what I have to do is when it comes time, I've got to put like wireless nodes off of this, and GPS the fluid to where I need it to go. Uh, this will be the hardest one, the diamond, because I need it to go to so many different individual blocks. This is going to go to two places. This is going to go to one, or vice versa. So it'll be that'll be pretty easy. Um, cool and the gang. Cool and the Gang is a band from like the 60s or the 70s. So when I say Cool and the Gang, I'm, I'm actually referencing an old band. I couldn't begin to tell you who was actually in the band. <laughs> I don't know. Check our fuels here. Still at maximum. Good. And still climbing. Halfway to maximum. So that's pretty good considering that one got to run all day. So I'm not seeing any problems here. It's still running at the right speeds. Um, so yeah, this is this is good. I am very pleased with all the work we got. We got this finished yesterday, this yesterday and today. And while this doesn't seem like a lot, there's a good amount of chunk in there. Plus we got all the statues done, right? All right, we've got 25 minutes left. It's not enough time to mess with too much stuff for the actual reactors. So here's what I'm thinking. Let's take a look and see if we can actually do this stuff now. Right? Uh, so we're going to see what we can do here. I may have to grow some trees to do this, but we're going to see. Um, first of all, let me grab planks. What kind of planks have I got here? Uh, mineral... Jungle, Dark Oak. Dark Oak. That's not Twilight. There it is. Tower Wood. I need a... T I need... I need... Oh, the ranged pump? Well, we could look at the ranged pump today, too, if you'd rather do that. I don't mind looking at the ranged pump. Let's see what a ranged pump does. I'll do that. Ranged pump. Where'd it go? Okay, let's just put in pump. There, no, that's the fluid pump. There it is, ranged pump. All right, what do I need? 
Just a thing of lava. That I can do. Bucket. I'm done with those tunnels. Put that away. Oh, and uh, let's put that away too. Not going to need that anymore today. Lava. And we'll put that in there. Here is a ranged pump. All right, well, it needs power. Okay. Uh, where's my flux at? Flux. I know I didn't use them all. There they are. Okay. It's got a little yellow bar on one side. And arrows are all pointing up. All right. You got power. Scanning. Rain empty. Well, uh, hmm. well, maybe I need a tank or something on top. Like, is it sucking up stuff from a range? Like, is it gonna grab lava from a? Yeah, okay, yeah, it is. So it's grabbing fluids from within a specific range. That's the lava outside. That's actually pretty cool. So it's scanning a specific range and sucking up its lava. And that's that's a pretty good sized tank too. That filled that pretty fast. I would be intrigued to know what would happen if you had more than one liquid in the same range though, right? You had water and lava in a given area, would it show priority? Not sure. So that just, from a range, sucks stuff up. That's pretty cool. I'm going to check that off. I mean, finding ways to use it, that's one other thing. We also got the door factory. I haven't made that yet. Excellent. Good callback. Thank you for reminding me we wanted to work with that. Door factory. Now, I have a tutorial on this. This is just a fun block. Door factory. Where will I place you? I will place you here. No, here. There, that's good for now. So the door factory, you can make your own custom-looking doors. Let's, for example, grab ourselves some ingots. I will grab uh, gold ingots... And iron ingots. Very base. Let's take a look at what we're going to do here. Uh, for the frame, I want gold. Oh, well, let me put it in there. Create. Let me do either of those. Why is this not working? Movement. Uh, what do I want? I want spinning. Uh, standard. Sound type. We're going to do... I need something kind of cool. Um... We'll do glass door. I mean, times six. That's all good. See, I need supplies, but it's not letting me put those in. Maybe it has to be blocks. Now that I think about it, I think it has to be blocks. So let's grab some diamond. I don't have any gold blocks. Diamond. Yeah, that's what it was. Uh, the frame, I want gold. Um, bottom block material, I'm going to leave as is. Why are you not giving me a door? Oh, I have to have all three. Okay. So now I have a custom-made door that looks like this. And it disappears and reappears. Oh, there's no sound because I'm, in, I'm close to a sound muffler. Let me move further away. Hello, Cherry Game. Good day. So you can make your own custom-looking door. You can have them disappear. You can have them do different ways of zooming in and out and such. Different doesn't take all materials. It does have to be blocks, but uh, it's a fun little thing to do. So you swap those out. So when you make a door, you've got your top and bottom. So if you want them to both be gold, I have to do both, like uh, that. There you go. Three different types of doors. I have them all set to spinning. They all make that noise. These are just too close to that muffler. So I like the door factory. It lets you make some really cool custom stuff. 
And like I said, when it comes, you have spinning, rotating, sliding four ways. Let's do that one. That sounds cool. Interesting. What would happen if we had two of those? Will it make a difference? Oh, that's kind of cool now. Ah -ha. See, I like that. So that's an interesting way to do it. I hadn't done one with four ways before. So, you know, if you ever wanted to, I don't think you can take these apart, though. I believe that once you make these, they're what they're going to be. I don't think so. Yeah, no recipe found. So if you don't like them, you just throw them away. <laughs> took a look, a look, a look. So there we go. Door factory. Always a fun block. Um... What was the other thing I was talking about looking at? I was going to look at a thing. What was I going to look at? We're going to look at that, and then, then you reminded me of that. Uh, door factory. Click that off. Uh, I forget what I was going to look at now. We're done with that, 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 that. Get those out of the way. Oh, right. Yeah, I remember now. Wood. Wood. All right. Let's grab ourselves a hopping bonsai. Grab ourselves some good mulch. Let's grab ourselves a chest. Get that set up. That, that, that. And let's get ourselves a twilight forest tree. So we can see whether or not this is going to work. Let's see. Sickly, I don't know, sickly part of this. Sickly in here. I don't see it. Canopy? So we got canopy, mangrove, twilight oak. Okay, let's see if we've got any of those. Um, twilight, there's the mangrove, okay. And there's canopy. Okay, let's do canopy, because canopy I'm more familiar with. We'll set a canopy in here, we'll get, get us some wood, and then we're going to see whether or not we can make anything with that. You're in the future. Hello from the past. Wood should be produced pretty quickly, so. All right. Let's see what the first... Let's, let's pick something and see if it works. Okay, uh, so we're looking at canopy, right? Okay, so in the middle row, fourth from the bottom, is canopy slab. It's an easy one to make. And the only way we're going to know this works is if I make one and then that disappears, right? So I'm going to make a canopy slab and see if that comes off the list. All right. Good sign. It's not on there anymore. All right. Let's find... There's a canopy plate. Let's find a canopy button. Because the buttons are the ones I know we had problems with before. There it is. Canopy button. It's on the left list. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven from the bottom, right under dark fence. I'm going to try to make a canopy button. Yeah, see, there it goes. It just becomes a regular button again. So that's still not fixed. Canopy button is still there. Dang it. I was. Somebody told me that they fixed that. See, so here's canopy button. It's the same recipe, but when you make it, it becomes a regular button, not a canopy button. Darn it. And it's the same with a lot of the stuff. Like, I mean, I don't have enough wood for a canopy fence. Let me fix that. Clear that out for a minute. And what was I going to do? Let's see. Canopy fence. That one worked. Canopy stairs. Canopy slab. No, see, that one became a, oak, a wooden pressure plate and not anything special. Canopy gates. That one worked. I don't think... A trap door, I think, is on that. That became a regular trap door. And that's where we ran into the problem trying to do it. You can get some of the stuff done, but then some other things are not going to go away because you just can't make them. They're just not there right. I wish, really wish that one had gotten fixed because that's been broken since it was added. Uh, cycle through the recipes. Um, okay. 
Well, I was doing that inside of a... There, but we can look at a regular crafting table. I'm fine with that. Regular crafting table. So, yeah, it just makes a regular button. You know, there's no other ways to change how it, how, what it turns into. And in my own personal inventory... Oh, I don't need that. I need this. Yeah, still turns into just a regular oak button. So no other options, unfortunately. Yeah, it's just one of those ones that's been broken since it got added and just never got fixed, unfortunately. But that's all right. Now we know. We know that there's still one achievement in Sky Factory 4 you cannot get. With sadness. I say that with sadness because I'd like to be able to make it. I really would. Um, okay, so we know that that one's broken, so we don't need to even look at that tab. All we have left are th three, four, five. And that's just me gathering a bunch of cobblestone and getting it in there. Which, that's going to take a lot of time and work. Um, but we'll get it, we'll get it done. I'll work on that one off camera. Just taking cobblestone and manually loading it in there, I guess. Uh, those we're working on next week. This one, I can farm netherrack and get that in there. That one, I, I already sped up a bit today by working on it. So, uh, I got it, I got it chunked up. We were at, like, we had three of the septuple, and I spent, like, 15 minutes doing it and got an, our fourth one. So, you know, it'll take me a couple hours, but I'll still be able to get it all done in there. Um... So we're, we're about done everything, other than building. Because I do want to build some stuff, right? It's not all about, once the achievements are done, then I can start making some, some other just custom stuff. I'm going to build a cool room with moon juice. I've done it before. I just like the way it looks. We got, we got all the statues done today. That's pretty cool. Which one are you going to give me? Glowstone? I thank you. Appreciate that. I'll take that. Who, who else can give me something? What are you going to give me? Magma cream? Okay, I'll take that. Uh, you can take one plank in your inventory, hover over another plank with it, hold left shit. I'll be honest, Stephen, that doesn't make sense to me. I'm not quite following what you're saying. I'm not saying you typed it poorly. I'm saying that it's my brain. Moon juice? Oh, yeah, I can help you. It's actually liquid starlight from the... Tw um, Mist no, not mystical. From Astral Sorcery. Boop. So up here in the sky, <laughs> I this is at build height above the lava. I had to go to the... Because I needed sunlight. Um, and if you make a light well and put these crystals in it, the rock crystals, it turns into liquid starlight, which is being funneled down to my, my air work area. Uh, right here. So I have buckets of liquid starlight. And I there's a there's a room design I've made in the past that I really enjoy making. I actually made it in this world while I was at the convention two weeks ago. But that was a copy of this world, so it's not in here. <laughs> but it, was, it gave me something to work on, and definitely a lot of people stopped by to look at it, which was kind of fun. So I'm going to build a room, a cool room. I don't know what I'm put in it yet, but we'll put something in there. Well, that's about it. We've done just about everything. We only got ten minutes left. There's not a whole lot else I can work on this evening. Um, in ten minutes, so that's all right. Let's take a look at our juices. Uh, Seven hundred thirty thousand. Seven million for liquid hydrogen. That's pretty good. Liquid hydrogen is pumping it out. I'm okay with that. And 80,000 of molten diamond. But this I'll need the least of. This one I'm going to have to speed up. I'll definitely jump in there and put more, more, of, the, uh, more of this setup in here. But I'm not sure I'm going to need to do a whole lot more with liquid hydrogen. Maybe one more row would be enough. Because I am going to use that in two machines. So I do need more of that. But I'll work on that. So we got a reactor up and going today. We got the statues done. And we got three 
fuel processes we need to build our reactors. So next week, we're going to build the large reactor and the small reactor at the same time and fire up the small one. Uh, on, I'm hoping to have the small one fired up Sunday night. Uh, so again, just a, a brief update of what's to come. Uh, so let's see. This week on Friday, I'm over on Twitch. Not sure what I'm streaming over there yet. Uh, but I'm going to do something on Twitch. I may do something silly. We're going to do something on Twitch on Friday. Um, and then... I need to remind everybody that the weekend after that, which is the Sunday the 7th and Monday the 8th, there will be no Minecraft streams that week. Um, Sunday, I'm going to be gone all day. My wife's getting a tattoo. And when I come home, I have to go right to sleep because i got to get up Monday morning at 4 o'clock in the morning and drive three and a half hours to Nashville so I could take my citizenship exam. So... Sunday and Monday will be a wash. Now, depending on how things go, I may do one. I don't normally stream Minecraft on Tuesday, but since I know I have to miss Sunday and Monday, I might do a Tuesday one that week, just so we can at least have one uh, and get to hang out a little bit. And then that Friday will be, I think, it's a Merch Worlds weekend. Um, but that's kind of how we're looking right now. So, what's today? Uh, the new stream schedule will be up in six days. I have it up, try to have it up by the first. Uh, if you'd like to see my stream schedule, you can find that in my Discord, or you can go to my website, onlydraven.com. While you're at the website, uh, you'll find links to all my socials, streaming schedule, things about my podcast, um, merch, ODG merch, if you only Draven Gaming merch, you want to check that out. The ODG store is on my website, and a bunch of other resources. So highly recommend checking out the website. Uh, and definitely join our Discord. Link for Discord you'll find down in the description of this and all my streams. Or you can find that on my website as well. Cool. I like it. I think I'm going to call it just a couple minutes early. I need to get some sleep. I'm so tired today. <laughs> I didn't sleep well last night. I'm going to crash out and get me a snooze. Because uh, i got to work in the morning. But I do again want to thank everybody who came and hung out today. I appreciate you. Uh, again, special thank you to everybody who clicked like. And subscribe if you don't mind doing that before you head out. I'd appreciate it. Even if you're watching this 10 years down the road, it'd be great. It still helps the channel. Last night we hit 25,000 subscribers on the channel. Uh, and 11.1 million views in the 7 years I've been a channel. So again, thank you all very much for helping make this channel what it is. I can sit here and talk to myself all day long. But if nobody comes to watch, the channel's useless, right? So thank you all for your participation. And as always, a very special thank you to uh, the members, people who are part of the membership program, people who are uh, sub over on Twitch. Uh, and again, there'll be new opportunities to get some cool op uh, new stuff through the Patreon. That I'm hoping to have up by the end of the month. Uh, and an extra special thank you to my moderators who help keep everything running. Because, you know, I'm useless on my own, right? All right, kids, I'm going to call it a night. Thank you all very much for watching. Have a great rest of your week. Swing by and see me next weekend. Or come visit me on my Twitch channel, Only Driving Gaming, on Friday. All right? Thank you very much for watching. Have a great day.